Good evening, everyone. An Idaho State Senator is working on legislation that would require high school student graduates to pass the naturalization test. It's the same test that the immigrants have to pass in order to be granted citizenship. Local News 8's Tyler Berg joining us now. Tyler, this is being proposed to the Senate Education Committee tomorrow? That's right. Under Senator Jim Patrick's bill, students could start taking the naturalization test in seventh grade. By senior year, though, students would have to get a passing score to graduate. I feel like I would pass it. I don't know. Idaho Falls senior Josh Kroos, like many of his classmates, wouldn't want to take the test. The seniors that are graduating have to take another test, first of all, but I don't, I don't feel like they should have to take that test to prove anything to anybody. Students would face questions on the Constitution, like how many amendments are included. 20... Uh, more 27? I don't know. That's right. As well as governmental questions like who would become president if Barack Obama or Vice President Joe Biden couldn't serve? Secretary of State. John Boehner. That's right. Speaker of the House John Boehner would assume the role, but we might be in good hands with Patricia Barrett. She seemed to know everything we threw at her. Who is in charge of the executive branch? The president. Chief Justice. Uh, Roberts. How many years is a U.S. Senator's term? Six. Name a U.S. territory. Guam. Who's your U.S. representative? Simpson. Who vetoes bills? Uh, Congress. Is that correct? The president does. Oh, okay. Matthew Sylvester says the test is just unnecessary for seniors already taking American history and government classes. More hoops and more hoops. And even Barrett, who almost aced the test, says she doubts seniors would be able to pass the required 60% proposed for the 2016 school year. I seriously doubt that uh, high school seniors know these things. We have a very uninformed populace. A lot, and I mean a lot of people I talked to today said they would like legislators, senators, and the rest of the state and country's politicians to take that test themselves. In the studio tonight, <laughs> I'm Tyler Burr. Boy, it sure started some good conversation in the newsroom that, this evening, right. didn't it, yeah. Tyler? <laughs> uh, Arizona just passed similar legislation in January, becoming the first state to do this, so we might be the second. Who knows? Who knows? Yeah. Someone